Good morning everyone, welcome to day night. Good morning everyone, welcome to day number three in Thailand. Currently it's around 10.30 and I'm walking to a bus station. Not a bus station, a bus stop. And right now we're trying to catch a bus, go to Wat Phu. Um, it's going to take around 30 minutes from where we're at right now. It's going to be an adventure because um, we're taking a bus as a group and I hope it's not going to be crowded. As you can see the traffic, super crazy at the moment. Like the street is so busy, not all taxi or want to go there. So we came here to Mitchet Station. We're going to go to visit the market over there. It's right there. I have never been here before, but my uncle said it's going to be good because they sell a lot of stuff here. And we'll see how it goes. So we're at a park right now near Mitchell Station and we're walking to the market. Uh, it is just, um, I don't know what it's called, it's, I think it's called Jaja Jar Market. Uh, it's only open on Saturday and Sunday. So it's good for us because we stay here Saturday and Sunday and we got here as well. <laughs> All the Native American hair pieces, the cowboy star. Right now we're inside the market and look. FCK, that's funny. Um, it's very hot, so I don't want to talk much. But I'll show you around what they have inside. They have everything pretty much. Clothing, shoes, bags, hats. Everything, carpet, and we don't know what we're going to buy, but I'm pretty sure they will buy a lot. I can see it's crazy hot at the moment but everything is very reasonable price like one shirt 100 to 200 baht that's like five dollar five Australian dollars and it's super hot I'm sweaty right now I have to take my hat off I mean I have to put my hat on otherwise I'm going to get sunburned real bad like this is just one alley the other have like the other side as well and behind that building as well. So at the back they're selling dried fruits, my mum buying some. Apparently it's much better, it's cheaper than in Australia. And we got some peanuts, some longin, I think, um, some crave as well. Um, they have everything. Look what I got. Grape juice for 10 baht. Mm. Very refreshing, it's cold. Oh, perfect for this weather. Hello. For Instagram. Did you see that food cart just then? That was fish cake. They're frying at the spot. Oh, it smells like so fishy, but it looks so yummy. Hello. <laughs> Oh, 
Josh Clark on the I've been walking here for like nearly two hours now. Currently it's two o'clock and we got here around 12-ish. Still have to film with my GoPro and everything. I got some socks and what else did I get? Pretty much some socks and one drink, that was it. My mom got three shirts, my uncle got, got sh like socks, shirts and like pants and everything. They shop too much. Finally, we got out of the market. That was very, very stressful because it was so hot and like all the entrants looked the same. So I had no idea where to go. Anyway, um, try to explain. I got my glasses on top. Try to explain my outfit today. I'm wearing, I'm wearing all black because I was thinking like we went to the um, Grand Palace and then um, to the temple and everything. So. That I have to be like respectful to the late king but then the traffic was so crazy not like taxi refused to go so that's why we came here instead to the Muchi station trying to find a place to stay now I, it seems like uh, like all good places are occupied it's 2 p.m. now we decided to have a picnic Thai star we bought some street food such as um, over there green papaya salad some fish Ball, fish cake and some like meatball as well and we got some like sticky rice and normal rice everything looks so delicious some pork as well I'm gonna show you around so what we have here we got sticky rice som tam which is the green papaya salad we got some pork fish cake and other fruits it looks so delicious and my uncle is live on Facebook right now which is normal in Cambodia that's what they do live everything is live but yeah come and eat with us so we finished our lunch day far behind I walk fast anyway I'm gonna go right to the Muchit train station and buy some tickets because they're slow um, we're going back to our hotel have some rest and then probably tonight in the evening we going to go out and eat some buffet. I hope so. Um, apparently, it costs like only twenty-two dollar for everything, so that's good. The lunch was amazing. Oh, I love it. We bought our ticket already from Wichita Station to um, Hatay Station. It costs um, thirty-seven dollars. I mean, thirty-seven baht. And when we came here, we came here from um, Wichita Station. Which cost um, 42 baht, I think. Which, yeah, around 42 baht. And right now it's so crowded that like, everyone came here. Look. Luckily, I came here first and bought a ticket. Oh my god. I hope we get a seat this time. Thank god we got a seat. All of us have a seat. Stay. So that's good. So from here to Patya Thai, I think it's going to be around, let me check, just 10 minutes from here to Patya Thai. So that's good. And then we're going to change the train from here to another train and go back to our other place. Just got off the train station, now we're walking. And you know, Bangkok, what it's known for? Traffic. Traffic jam all the time. And we decided to walk from here to our hotel. It's gonna take like around 10 more minutes. So it should be alright. So after 10 to 15 minute walk, we nearly make it to our hotel, right there. I walk super fast, they like follow me, bring me behind. But anyway, can you believe it? Like, I've been here for so many times. I think four or five times, I think four times now. And I still haven't like, got to ride the tuk-tuk or the motorbike. I guess they have it in Cambodia as well. So, it's not really the like, unique experience for me, because I've tried before in Cambodia. And look, so much stuff. Right now we are on our way to the Bayuk Sky Hotel, like the tallest one over there. 
um, looking for a buffet. Apparently, you have to book. So I'm not sure if it's full or not because today is Saturday. Yeah, and it's only 22 American dollars. So we'll see how it goes. 